<laughs> all right, guys, it's time to get all awesome. The dudes, g gals, we're not sexist on this show. I, I don't know why I felt the need to say that. Uh, oh, hello, fucking, uh, uh, yeah, yeah, I know, I'm using this image that I used in, like, one video, because, because, fuck it, right? So, you know, th this is me, you know, as for fucking usual, I'm gonna make a dub video, like, like usual. Too. Uh, wait, that, that was a horrible intro, god damn. Take a look on my screen, you see that little video right there, that little video called Dusty to Belong Beyond the Light fucking launch trailer? Oh my god, look how many dumbass. <laughs> you know, it's actually, wait, A, A, U? Wait, what is, wait, what does that mean? Wait, wait I'm retarded, that means, fuck it. Wait, <laughs> why does it say A, U right there? I don't know, it's, it's weird, I, I didn't even notice that. Anyway, this fucking trailer, you know, I, I'm, just, I'm just gonna come out and say I'm not fucking impressed, and it's gonna fucking suck, but, but hey, 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 hey. I mean, those are some pretty big words coming from a dumbass like me, so, you know, obviously, I have to back up my stupidness by showing you exactly what's going on. I mean, it may have finally become evident, but, uh, Destiny isn't a fucking good game. I mean, ever since their first one, they've just been going downhill ever since, but here, allow me to elaborate on that just, just a little bit further. Destiny fucking 1 was the fucking worst game ever. I mean, the sales were good, but the point is, they thought that the people who made up Halo were gonna make up another Halo, but they got bullshit, okay? The gameplay was... It was pretty good. I mean, I gotta say, a lot of people are just stupid, like, a little bit too... <laughs> like, the <laughs> like, the fucking gameplay was simple as shit. I mean, it wasn't, like, garbage or anything. But it wasn't stellar or something new that you haven't already seen before. You shoot your gun, you do your weird, magical, fucking, little Twinkie Toes fucking powers. And that was it. It wasn't anything stellar. Everyone hated the game because the story just fucking sucked. There were those who said, well, I'm just a looter shooter. It's a fucking game, not drama, blah, blah. And I'm like, oh my god. So what happened to people actually having two brain cells? Is everyone just out there just trying to go with the, you, you know, the freaking... Boom, the bam, the f crash, the plow, the skin... Like, what a time to be a gamer. Like, I'm being serious. Like, like, wow, what, what a time to be a gamer. Just to fucking go around and go... Pfft, pfft. Wow, you know. <laughs> it was... Then their first DLC came out, and it was fucking mediocre. It was garbage. The story was stupid. It was only a couple of missions, by the way. And the only thing that saved this fucking DLC was the raid. The raid's pretty cool. I like it. You get to use a sword. You know. <laughs> But, once again, it was just stupid. <laughs> it was a pretty bad DLC. Most people agree with me on that. Then House of Wolves came out, and it was even worse than the first DLC, because it, this time, it didn't even have a raid, so, the, so so it couldn't even save itself. Couldn't even help itself in any single way. Once again, the, once again, the story sucked. But, but, but hey, can, take, take, take a look at this fucking face. This fallen face. It looks kind of familiar, Dun, done it? D done it? Done it? Just fucking wait. Hmm, hmm, who, 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 who the fuck does that look like? I mean, like, like, am I the only one who sees this shit? The Fallen are the most stereotypical shit I've ever seen, and every boss looks the fucking same if you really think about it. And this is just another fucking example of the same shit being blasted onto the screen to make us go fucking, ooh, guys, poggers. <laughs> then, a shining line of hope came out of fucking nowhere. Destiny to take a king was fucking awesome. Raid? That was stupendulous. Then he got some new fucking powers. Got electricity over here. Thing over there. Thing over there. You know, there's one thing that I've always noticed about that fucking arrow thing that the dude has. Why doesn't it... Like, I like how, like, the hunter does his own thing. But, like, with, like, the... This dude and this dude. You know, Titan and Warlock. Their power is just that. It's just power. It's just used to go... And, you know, fuck. Fuck. <laughs> fucking... But like, with this thing, like, the arrow, fuck, the arrow isn't very strong, like, even if you aim at someone's head. I don't know, it's, like, at a boss, it, like, like, if you use one of these supers on a boss, you know, it, it'll fucking kill him. But, like, with the arrow, like, it makes them, like, dizzy or, like, distracted or something, I can't even fucking remember. I, I don't know, it's kind of a thing that it does. But the point is, it had a simple story. Taking King, this dude in the background, which will come over here kill you because you killed the son. I guess that's kind of, kind of my one thing that I don't like. The thing is, uh, like, what if you never played the fucking Crota's End, which is entirely possible. Like, imagine that you didn't do that, and he's just here to kill you for basically no fucking reason. He's like, oops, I killed the wrong guardian. He didn't kill Crota, it was some f other dumb fuck. <laughs> That's about it. Everything else was awesome. The atmosphere was fucking awesome. I like the take-in, shit like that. It was all really cool.
Then came the rise of fucking Iron. This fucking dude, Lord Saladin, is the most stoic, dumbass fucking character I've ever seen in anything. I fucking hate this thing. The raid, of course, as per usual, was awesome, so I can't say anything about that. But everything sucked again. I mean, I liked how the game looked and shit, but here's the thing that I even hated about the Taken King and every other DLC, including in Destiny 2. The, the enemies are the same. The enemies are the same. The areas are the same. The guns. The, even the fucking powers, we're really looking deep into this shit. They're all the same. They're all the same. This was mediocre. It was done. It was kaput. It was so boring that whenever I usually look up shit for Destiny, like, I used to watch the cutscenes on YouTube because I was I'm a little dumbass. And, like, I would usually forget that this even existed. It was one of the most forgettable fucking DLCs ever. It fucking sucked. It fucking sucked. But then one day, you're sitting in your fucking home, you know, you're just watching YouTube, you see a trailer for Destiny 2 and you're like, <laughs> What? I thought this game died after the fucking dumbass, pathetic, fucking final DLC of The Rise of Iron in their last game. <laughs> but the trailers came out, Cade was in the trailers, she was like, Oh man, this game's gonna be so good. But you know what I love? Everyone hated it. See, unlike Vanilla Destiny, so you see, like, see, here's the and when Vanilla Destiny first came out, we were all starry-eyed children. And you know what? We actually bought into their bullshit that was Destiny 1. But over time, we learned just how fucking mediocre and dumb that first game was. Like, we, we, we realized it. And we didn't listen to the fucking guys who went, uh, Gun goes pew pew. <laughs> Whenever Destiny 2 came out, we were mad. We were freaking mad, dude. We, we were mad. <laughs> we couldn't take it anymore. We were done with this mediocre bullcrap. Once again, this like the story was even worse than Destiny 1. Destiny 2's watch was worse than Destiny 1. <sighs> again, as per usual, just like Destiny 1, the sales for Destiny 2 were like out of the fucking roof. So, I mean, it's not like the team who created the game gave a shit. They're like, ha ha, you fucking bitches. They were like, ha ha ha, you fucking dumbasses. You bought our fucking retarded game. You actually bought it. You thought that we changed? <laughs> and strangely, just like the first game, they, they came out with two DLCs. Their first one was the Curse of Iris. Uh, Iris? <laughs> freaking... Every fucking DLC was Curse of Yo Iris. And then the other DLC was fucking Big Brain Time. And the freaking... The other thing is that the raids throughout the entire game pretty much suck. They're not very good. I mean, how do you fuck up something as simple as a raid? Fuck it. Oh my god. Then Destiny 2, then they had like a third DLC that was good, like Taken King, but just kidding, this one is bad. I don't know what fucking people are talking about because they're literally retarded, but allow me to explain why this one is fucking dead. <laughs> dad looks like. I can't even speak! The first one is Kay's death. Kay's death doesn't make any sense for a myriad of reasons, but number one, I don't care that he died, I care that the fucking... So like a couple years back, I created a video called Destiny 2 Kay's Black Rizzy. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody watched my video. <laughs> Gargle. Mostly because the fact that the Traveler can't make up another ghost for Cade is fucking retarded. That's what I said inside the video. I don't care what you say. I don't care if you know all the fucking lore. It doesn't make any sense that the Traveler, even though it's fucking awake now, even though it killed Gaul, can't create one fucking ghost for Cade. So you can just fuck off and try to say that doesn't make any sense, you fucking dumbass. Like, this really does make me mad. Like, like, I know that, like, I'm getting aggressive. Like, it's because I really care about Kate. He's, like, the only character that anyone fucking likes. And it makes sense, too. He's really cool. And his death was, like, good. Like, I understood why he died. I totally understood that. Like, I always question why didn't, like, like your enemies just shoot your fucking ghost? Then it would die. Then you would die forever. But still, as I said before, why didn't... Why didn't the Traveler just create another ghost form? What a dick move the Traveler just made, you know? Like, what the fuck? Anyway... So basically, the other thing that sucks about this is, well, your morality. I mean, I'm not gonna say that in the Taken King you add any character either, because you really don't. Throughout the entirety of every Destiny game, you have no character. You don't know who you truly are, and it kind of sucks. And what you could say, well, you can emulate yourself onto it. Well then, what if you didn't like Kate? What if you hated Kate? And then you just, and then in the one cutscene, which is crazy, every fucking voice actor came back to say like two fucking words. You were like, old from Solve is mine. It's gonna be <laughs> Pluggers, dude. Like, this is fucking stupid. For one, I hate this black bitch. The, like, a lot of people don't like Blue Dude over here, but I really do like him. Like, I'm being dead serious. I like, what, what's his fucking name? Uh, fuck. It's, uh. Uh. Look, I can't. I can't remember, I'm sorry. But I do like this dude in Cade. They're like the only two characters in the entire thing that I liked. 
I like him because, like, he's a stern, focused titan who just wants to protect everybody and build the wall. Okay, well, I, that, that came out wrong. Um, anyway, the point is, this black chick over here was, like, fucking... <laughs> He was like, let's send every guardian out there to fucking to kill him. And then this dude over here is like, uh, we can't do that. That's fucking stupid. But we're not going to send anyone. If I was the guardian, I mean, literally, whenever I was fucking playing this shit, I was like, why, why don't, why don't, why don't we just send a fire team of three to go into a strike and kill Aldrin Zog, you dumb fucks. But they never say that. Like, it's fucking stupid. Like, it's fucking, it's fucking stupid. Then there's Aldrin Sov. Aldrin Sov isn't even the bad guy, because if you see over here on the left, you see this tiny little tentacle, but don't worry. Don't worry, I'm not gonna show you tentacles. This, this is a kid-friendly show here, but the point is, Aldrin Sov isn't the bad guy until you watch at the end, where he's being controlled by a tentacle monster. I actually thought it was kind of cool, but then we shoot this motherfucker anyway, and I'm like, what the fuck? Why did we shoot him? Oh yeah, there's also this fucking deleted cutscene where he comes back with a ghost, and I'm like, who fucking gives a shit? Who cares? Also, 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 get this. Get this. Look, look at this. Petition to let us kill Aldrin Solve again. Like, who the, who the fuck... Oh, Aldrin again. Like, who the, who the fuck said that? <laughs> Aldrin did nothing wrong! <laughs> he did nothing wrong! Look at, look at, look at, look at, look at that true fear written all over his face. The temple. Trying to fucking... And then Destiny 2 Shadow Keep came out and it was just like Rise of Iron. And then it was mediocre. It was forgettable. No one, no one remembered. remember it. It was fucking garbage. And everybody ate it. As per usual. So, uh, so now can you see why I'm not fucking excited for this shit? It's going to be the same shit. Because again, it's the same planet. It's the same enemy. It's the same shit. You're going to get a new power. And now I think that the Fallen are going to have new powers. But let's face it. The leveling in this game is also kind of abysmal. You can instantly level up against anyone else. Except for like guardians, I guess, or like bosses. But like, like this shit's gonna suck. Like, wake up, wake up, people, wake up! I can't be the only one who feels like this. Like, I can't be the only one. IEG probably feels like this. Am I the only one who's alive? Am I the only one who understands? Like, why this game sucks? This is like weird. Like, everyone was saying, I hate Destiny 2, and now they're like, Oh my God, they've come back to great. You know, I. I it's, you know, really, I actually couldn't really give much of a shit, because I'm not going to play it, so I don't care. So, fuck you. See that? It's a middle finger. No one's kind of hard to see, because cause <laughs> I should write with pen or something. <laughs> but, fuck you guys. You guys are a bunch of idiots if you're really so hyped for this game or fucking whatever. You guys are a couple of fucking dumbasses. Anyway, video over. See ya, dog.